How's it going everybody? Before you watch this next video, can you do me a big favour and like this video, subscribe to this channel and hit the bell. Help me grow this channel which so that I can do regular uploads as I am doing but with better and more detailed content. Thank you and enjoy the video. Hey everybody and welcome back to Boo's Review. I love doing these and apparently you all love me doing them because the view time is going up on the Boo's Reviews compared to my other videos. Uh, I tend to get a few subscribers every time I do one and it just gets all together a good reception. People are leaving comments which are awesome. Um, it, not necessarily saying do this, do that. Just support saying that they're enjoying it and I couldn't ask for anything else really. So thank you so much for that. Um, so as I just showed it really close, it's Copperberg Rosé. Now, I don't know how long this has been about. I saw it in the shop today and um, it, they put it away from all the other ones, um, like the mixed berries and things like that, which I think we've all tried. It's a definite summer drink, Copperbergs. Um, so I picked it up and thought, I'll give it a try. Now obviously Strongbow's just released a rose, but um, a rosé, sorry, or however you want to pronounce it. Um, but I couldn't get any of them. They had big packs and I've just, been buying whiskey and things at the moment so I can't go buying too much I'll get in trouble um but I saw this one and it was like I say it was a single bottle so I thought brilliant you know I'll give this one a try and a review either way I've not tried it before so that makes it okay to obviously do this review video if I'd already tried it I won't bother I might have just tweeted about it and said you know try it or don't so I'm just gonna crack it open not normally meant to happen, there's a tray that catches it. Um, I've had some feedback as well about my setup, um, just with Miracle Bar and that in background, so thanks for that one, it's taken me a while to get it all together. Anyway, without anything else being said, I'm going to give it a crack and we'll see what it tastes like. Mmm, that's nice. It's um. It's got that. It's it's nice and it's refreshing, and what I like about it is, it's it's got that taste of like traditional cider, um, like the you know the appley the cloudiness to it. But then there, there is that. I wouldn't say it's like. Yeah, in fact, I would say that it's like a mix of a cloudy cider and a rosé wine, like a pink wine, um, which might sound unappealing, but. It actually sounds, um, it actually tastes pretty good, like it's all the best um, features of those drinks are mixed together in this one, um, which is really good. Sorry, I've just noticed I've nudged the camera. There we go, even better. You can see a bit more of this now. Um, yeah, it's it's got the best features of them both, so um, mm. let me have another swig. Yeah, that is nice. It's, um, I don't know how to explain it to be honest, it's like, I want to say it got a bit of a berry hit hint to it, but that's not really what's been gone for with this drink I guess, but it's, like, yeah, it's got the best features from a rosé and a, a normal traditional cider, uh, not like a strongbow or anything like that, like a proper cloudy cider, um, which is obviously what you want in a cider, it's got to be proper, um, it's only 4% volume, it, which is a shock, I suppose, because with the like your traditional ciders can be up to like six, seven percent. Um, I suppose it's because it is the rose and they've probably altered it a bit, but it's really nice that uh, I'm a bit worried because I'm I can be funny with uh, rose flavored things, especially rose wines. You know, the, you can get some really dry ones, which dry wine I don't like to really touch, it's got to be sweet, but with a high percentage for obvious reasons. Um, but now that is a good cider. That's all I can really say about it. It's it's really nice, and I recommend it highly. It's um, it's one of them you can drink like pop. Really, I don't know if that's just me because I like to, I do like to have a drink. Um, might get Mrs. Try it later. See what she thinks. She probably won't like it. She's not as big a drinker as me. Um, but I think that you know it's a really good drink. Um, for this time of year, even though it's pissing it down at the moment, but yeah, cannot recommend it enough. It's really nice. I'm enjoying it. If I see a bigger pack, I will definitely be picking it up. 
So um, it's nice to change this to not actually be reviewing a spirit. Um, and yeah, thank you for watching. Like I say, the reception I've been getting on these videos is absolutely brilliant. Keep it up. Leave a comment. If there's any other ciders you think that are worth a try, let me know. Um, other than that, leave a like, please subscribe, it helps me out loads and it, it helps me know that this is the content you're still enjoying. Um, other than that, I'm going to see you next time, so thank you for watching, peace.